Hey, it's Andre, and well, you're looking at a print. Uh, unfortunately, I'm noticing some issues I didn't quite see in the uh, in the slicer. But the idea, once this is cool enough, if it comes off, there we go. This is unfortunately a little. Oops. This is unfortunately a little. Yeah, I have to clean some of that up and everything. Some flaws. But the idea is this is a 70 mil EDF cow. 70 mil EDF, stick the 70 mil in there. In theory, this will fit. There is another one, I'll link the video, not the video, but the Thingy Universe link to this thing. Um, uh, there is a two piece one that might work a little better, but uh, for the most part, uh, let's get my straight up some wires here. Holding a camera and doing this at the same time. There's obviously those little pieces on the outside of the EDF. Okay, well, while the camera was off, I took the time to use my snips and cut away all the little stringy bits on the interior of the part. And as you can see, there is an EDF sitting in there. This is just a simple 64 millimeter 3S. There's a 70, the 70, the 74S would fit um, if I cut those tabs off see those guys there uh, I'm very tempted uh, to possibly print the two-piece version and maybe make this a little stronger it is pretty thin wall but it's got to be light enough that it doesn't add any serious weight but that's not bad obviously um, the output isn't as narrow but I can narrow that down through some other techniques and everything but visually if you look at from that side this all these many defects are from the uh, supports punching through um so i'm gonna have to go back i didn't see that when i was in the slicer uh they're not in the two-piece version they're definitely in the one-piece version though so maybe i'll print the two-piece off and try this only took like under four hours the two-piece is a lot more for printing obviously uh, so interesting enough but uh, good little test good little quick little pla not a lot of views anything so just nice to see the 3d printer working again i'm andre there's a nice 3d printer part